Hi, this is a video to um, explain how to schedule tweets. So the first thing you need to do is go to TweetDeck. So just type in TweetDeck and it should come right up. And if you're logged into your Twitter account, TweetDeck links to your Twitter account. All right, so now what you want to do to schedule a tweet is you're going to hit the tweet bar to indicate you're going to you're ready to tweet All right so once you indicate that it opens up a new column and notice in this column this is just like a regular um, Twitter tweet where you can um, just enter the information you want up to I think it's 140 characters um, adding hashtags and all of those things you can tag other people, etc. I'll just um, go ahead and do one. Let's see. Together for L's, the hashtag. Uh, let's see. So, and I'll just tag um, someone. Let's see. And so. All right, so that would be your regular tweet. The difference, if you want to add an image or a video, you can just click there. Once you click there, it will give you the option to link um, images and video into your tweet, just like a regular tweet. The big thing is scheduling tweets. So when you click schedule tweet, when you click schedule tweet, it's going to give you the option of choosing a time or a date. I think you can schedule a tweet up to 10 days in advance and I believe up to 24, maybe 23 hours in advance. So it gives you just like a few minutes. So in this case, it's about 9, 9.05 Eastern. So it gives you maybe about 20 minutes or so, 9.22. So what you'll do have to do is to make sure you change the time. Let's say if this tweet is going to be at um, during a uh, let's say Thursday's um, chat. So I'd make sure that I'm indicated the 23rd of April and the scheduled time. I usually if um, if an if a question is going to be tweeted at say 7:05, I like to schedule it maybe a minute. Or maybe two minutes after. So let's say, um, we'll say seven oh six. You want to make sure it's just p.m. You can choose toggle between p.m. and a.m. And once it's there, then it's ready to go. This is your the information that will be in your tweet. This is the time that will be tweeted, and then. From there, you just tweet at, and it gives you a check mark. And also, it has a column. So this is how your tweet will look. This is how your tweet will look. It, and all your tweets are going to go under the scheduled column tweets. Right? If you realize, oh, I made a mistake, or I left someone out. You can edit the tweet, so just click on the pencil, it opens back up, and say, oh, I'm going to tag um, uh, someone else, say, so you can tag another person as well. So just, again, go now, tweet, and usually if you refresh, it will update your tweet for you. So there you go. This is... Your tweet is going to go out at 7.06 p.m. Thursday at on the 23rd of April. You say, oops, I forgot to include the format A1. There you go. You got your check mark and refresh. And there you go. All right. And all of your tweets are going to 
appear in this column. Let's do one more. Again, tweet. A2. You can also um, do your answers on a separate sheet and you can copy and paste in as well. I like to do mine in Word or Note notes and then I will copy that information into the the tweet. My favorite blah 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 then hashtag and then again tweet or schedule tweet excuse me We'll say this is going to go at 7, 16 p.m. on Thursday, the 23rd. Okay. Confirm. Tweet. There's a check. And then refresh. And now I have two tweets that are scheduled. So you can schedule all of your tweets here. They'll appear in this column. And you don't even have to have this on. You don't even have to be logged in to, to TweetDeck. These will just go out automatically. All right, so um, that's it. Good luck.